Hello everyone, welcome back to Quest for Glory 1, 2, 3. Wages of War? Yes. Yes, that's it. Like I said, I got myself all the way back here. This time I did not get poisoned by the plants, and I did purchase everything that uh, I forgot to purchase before. Uh, I'll give you a rundown of all that. I needed to have two water skins, five zebra skins, a tender box, honey, fine spear, fine dagger, beads, carving, and fine robe. I also talked to that uh, Keta again, and I actually talked about uh, Shapir so that I could have the conversation to give them the letter, and then I did everything else as I did the last time. So, let us continue, because now I won't die while entering the Simbani village. Oh, my voice, uh, my throat feels a little clogged. Give me a second, I'm going to drink a little bit of water. Uh, all right, let's get back to playing. Hajamumbo Mabawana Hajamumbo Uhara Hujambo Simba. You both look healthy and happy to be home again. It is very good to be home. I'd be happy to show you both the way to the Simbani. We are honored. Come then, we shall meet with the leader of the Simbani, the Leobon. Umbari, Leobon, Kubawa, Mzuli, Waria, Uhura. Leobon, I, Uhura, warrior of the Sambani, be standing before you with two warriors from far lands. Habari, warriors. Missouri, Sana, Leobon, Mkwaba, Mkwaba, it is good to be, oh, sorry, wrong voice. It is good to be seeing you again, great leader of the Sambani. It is good to be... Oh no, deep voice. It is good to be seeing you, Oreo Rakish. Leobon, I have come here to bring peace to your people and the Leobon man. I have sworn this by my honor. Missouri warrior, bring the Leopard man chief to his knees before me and you shall have peace as you pledge. What has caused this great anger from the leopard men, Leoban Mukwabaunai? The leopard men have always been our enemies. They be sneaky and not to be trusted, for they only travel at night. The worst of it all, that they use magic. The leopard man is the enemy. If the Simbani be seeking a lost calf in the jungle at night, then the leopard man uses magic against him. A Simbani cannot fight magic, so he must retreat. The leopard man will not meet the Simbani in a fair fight. The leopard men will always be our enemies, and now they have made us call for war. They stole from us the spear of death, and for that they shall die. Then they will no longer be our enemy. There are ways to resolve the conflict between the Simbani and the Leopardmen other than through waging war. I would like to see you, Liban from the Simbani, and the chief of the Leopardmen, speak your grievances before the Hall of Judgment in Tirana. Perhaps there can yet be a peaceful resolution to this conflict. No, Rakish, that spear of death is stolen and we will fight to reign our pride the worth of the spear will be paid in blood not words i have spoken kawaharami kawaharai lebon farewell lebon of the Sambani. may we meet again in peace you walk all the way back to uhura's hut to rest and discuss things before the evening. That is the crackle of fire. That 
That is a terrible fire sound. It is it is good to be back in your home. Very good, very good, but some uh, well worth leaving my home for. The Levon was most gracious to see us. Yet I fear though we were not welcome, I do not understand, for I have always respected him. How did we offend him, Uhura? I be not knowing, Rakish. The Shinbari have lost much honor with the stealing of the Spear of Death. Still, for the Libon, not to listen to your words of peace, not be right. Perhaps you will listen to it another time. It be time we be sitting too much. Maybe we go out to the village. The villagers be waiting to see you ra again, Rakish. They be killing a young bullock in your honor, and the blood be very fresh. The Sambali celebrate your arrival with meat, milk, and dancing. It is the it is late when you finally make it back to your hut. We were treated royally by the Sambali. That was meat from the Levon's own herd. I will head back to Tirana at first light. Find out what you will, uh, what you can about what is going on. I do not think the Levon told us everything he knows. If you can find the Spear of Death, we may be able to convince the Levon that war is unnecessary. Good luck. Do whatever you can to win the respect of the Simbani. We will undoubtedly be here, there, need their cooperation to restore peace. You talk about the events of the day. It was indeed an exciting day today, young hero. The Levon, the Levon told us what he wanted us to know. War. Perhaps he'll need to earn his trust. I do not understand why the Leopard Men would want to fight the Simbadi. The Leopard Men. The Leopard Men usually stay in the jungles. They are only out at night. The Simbadi, on the other hand, stay on the savannas and they hunt only by day. There is little interaction between the tribes. That the Leopardmen would suddenly start a war not only with this embody but with my people as well is something beyond my belief. The jungle is just to the east of here. The Leopardmen have their village hidden there somewhere. It is said to be protected by magic. Magic? Kresha believes that the spell on the Leopardmen village prevents outsiders from even seeing the village. It is said that no one can see what the Leopardmen does not want to, want to see. The savanna is very beautiful, but can be very dangerous. Take care of your friend. The dangers of the savanna is places of safety far apart. Do not travel too far from them before you know what you are doing. Safety. You will be safest in Toronto or in the village. It is supposed to be magically magical lake somewhere to the south that will be safe as well. All right, we're basically learning all the stuff we need to know about where things go, what to do. Uhura can't go against her people. She is a warrior. She can't turn her back on her people as a warrior. She must do as she's told. Uh, skill, yep, they're good at trials of the tribe. Yep, you'll probably have to do the trials of the tribe. Completion, yep, it takes time to do it. Uh, status, she... I wish to have a child, but a war wife cannot be a warrior. Now, has Simba, no man here can claim her. She remains a warrior. Uh, yeah, yeah. Plans. Like I said, I'm going to go back to Toronto. We're going to try and figure out what's going on. You try and figure out what's going on with the Simbani. Look into the demons, and the demons are here again. We must figure out what's going on with the demons. The Raja still believes the war is honorable. Yep. Uh... Honor, somebody in the essence of honor, trusted people, try all the members. Uh, they obey the laws of the thing. To a honor is doing whatever it takes to bring about the greatest good for all. Uh, pride. The line of Taurus Pride. It's the group that we're from. The word pledges of honor, patience of peace. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, well, I didn't talk about missions. Uh, the missions are stuff to know. The way of the paladins is difficult. Judgment. 
trust. Yep, you'll need to earn trust and respect. People need to trust you to be a paladin, and we're done. Good night. And you pass out on the floor, unbeknownst to all the others. You awake as the sun begins to rise. Rakish has left the hut first light. You vaguely remember hearing his farewells. Let's get away from that weird fire sound. All right, what do we do now? Uh, go to the bridge area. Practice, okay. Uh, bridge area. There's the bridge area. Nope, that's spears. What about over here? Hamari Hero of Shapir, this be the place where the Simbani practice balance and, and judgment. This is where Wrestling Bridge, the last part of the initiation contests, are held here. Climbing up the bridge, climbing up the bridge. What are we going to do? Look at my balance, look at my glory, look at how fast I roam. Look at that, I can walk the bridge. Very good, young hero, you be learning well how to balance on the bridge. If you wish to be to learn learning how this bridge is used for an initiation contest, come down and I will show you. We're trying to learn how to be part of the tribe. Walking on the bridge is easy part, but when someone else is on the bridge, it takes gets tricky. Look at me, look at me, ah do do. Uh, when you walk on this bridge, keep your feet on the outside of the logs. Feet apart give better balance. One way to make your opponent fall off is to jump. Keep your knees bent when you land because the boards under your feet will be moving up and down from the jump. Another way to throw off your opponent is to lean hard to one side and put all your weight on one foot. Yet another way is to be to make your opponent fall down is dropping down. You should practice these moves next time you are up here. It takes practice to do them and not fall off yourself. When you are good at the moves, uh, practice together. Long walks, time on the beach. Yep, wrestling bridge. <laughs> All right. So, let's climb back out there and see if we can figure out how to do these jumps and jives. Ah, there we are. All right, it's fairly easy. It's just like the combat. You just click. Uh, let me see if the nub lock will work. Yeah, it works better with the nub lock off. Yeah, all right. And we're done. Okay. So, exit the bridge and return there. All right, let's go back to the bridge. Uh, uh, interested in trying to wrestle with me on the bridge. Why, yes, I am. <laughs> I accept your challenge, Uhura. I needed a sip of water. So we need to knock her off. All right, contest from the middle of the bridge, wait for the judge to start, and then do what we do. Keep your balance, uh, move things up, down, left, right. I will show you. After I jump, drop down to your knees and stay balanced. Wrong wood. I fell down. Oops. Let's try that again. The knees are the 
other way. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. There we go. Now when I dodge to my left, you move to your left. And then right. Uh, watch me try and counter my move. Okay. No, I should have jumped. go. I want to do this. And then this. And this. And this. And let's jump. And jump again. Oh! We knocked her off. You are indeed a quick warrior. Let's try that again. I'm just going to use the mouse to click. It makes more sense for me. Let's jump. And that way. And that way. And that way. And jump. And jump. And that way. And that way. And that way. Oh, I fell down. All right. Well, I did win. Let's try this again. See if we can actually beat her twice in a row or three times in a row. Oh, okay, I'm too tired. That's all right. We will take a stamina pill. That's poison cure. That's mana. That's healing. I don't have any stamina pills. All right, that's fine. All right, this be the place where you throw spears. Spears are good. Spears are happy. Take a spear. Right on the bullseye. A little high. Let's see. Oh, you retrieve your spears. And the spear on the target. Basically, there's wind. That's what this flapping way thing is. You have to counter the way the wind blows. I'm going to sleep for an hour. That would be hazardous to our health. Health. Our health. All right. Let's try this again now that we're a little rested. Yeah, our stamina is not up that high, but... All right, the wind is blowing that way, so I should aim this way. Move here. All right. Maybe if he's better at pulling the spear, what do you wish to compete with her? Accept the challenge. All right. I throw, you throw, we all throw. All right. So if I aim here, that was a little high. A little low. And we got the spears. Uh, you have beaten me. 
see the throwing of spears. I do not do not stop practicing, though. There are still many who be better than throwing spears in an eye. Very good. It just never hurts to be better. To be winning this initiation contest, you will need to be even more skilled at throwing than... I am sorry, I burped there. Uh, do these use throw three, target three, three row, target, yep, practice. So it's going that way, so... Whoa, I completely missed there. All right. Basically what it is, you throw up the target and you hope that the uh, flag doesn't mess with you because the flag is the way the wind is blowing. All right, so we've done the spears. Uh, go back. I won. Exit. Search for a dinosaur and kill him to get his horn. All right. I actually want to rest again so that we are, well, rested. So let's check on our skills. Yeah. Hopefully that's enough that we'll survive. Alright, so we're supposed to leave the village and look for a dinosaur. And Barani, you have heard the news of the village. A pris prisoner has been captured. Okay. Oh, hold on. Alright. We are supposed to find... A dinosaur. Yep, that would be a dinosaur. Let us face him in combat. Alright, that was not a dinosaur. That was an alligator man or a crocodile man. Alright, that was not what we were looking for. That's another crocodile man. All right. Can we rest? No. Herb. Well, you know what? Let's go all the way here. Well, we're not going to find it. I believe this lake is where we're headed. As you approach this pool of bubbling water, you feel a sense of serenity and peace. Let's fill our water. You fill your water skin from the pool. Alright, our water skins should be completely full now. Uh, water from the Pool of Peace. Alright, cool. What are we doing now? Oh, yes. Actually, we're going to end this off here because I have actually run over my three minutes. So, until next time, a later.